Hi there, warm welcome. You're watching Blueprint Explosive Exclusive with me, Meghna Dekha. First up on the bulletin, let's try and imagine the horror of innocent civilians being burned to death in a place of worship. Well, that's exactly what had happened on the 1st of November 1984, when three Sikh men were burnt alive in the Gurdwara Pulbangash in Delhi. The man accused of instigating that mob is Congress leader Jagdish Teitler, who allegedly for long has maintained that he has had no role to play in the violent riots that took place and uh, after the assassination of Indira Gandhi and also claimed 3,000 lives as per even official records. In fact, the CBI has filed a charge sheet on the 20th of May this year where they asserted that there was a clear-cut case against Teitler and three eyewitnesses testified to seeing Teitler instigate the mob that was behind this gruesome act. Another witness said that he was threatened. Well, today the Delhi High Court has said that found sufficient material to proceed with the case and has summoned the Congress leader to appear before it on the 5th of August. Because there has been so strong evidence against him right from the very beginning. But using his power, political power and money power, he has been saving from the clashes of the law. So many people had seen him. Because you see, these are not the blind murders. These murders, they, these people have committed in the open daylight, in front of everybody. But it is their pressure and their power that nobody is prepared to come forward to depose. Now, the one person who came forward, he threatened him, he threatened his family, he put pressure on him for, through his family. So, as a result, because of that reason, and the CBI also didn't do the proper investigation. Well, the victims' testimonies make for a chilling read. The victims have claimed that Jagdish Teitler was the man giving orders on the streets and was behind the cold-blooded murder of countless people. 39 years on, all these victims are still fighting for justice. One of the witnesses, a person who has been fighting through this case, Mr. Manjeet Singh GK is with us. Sir, you are in this case, witness hai. Aaj cognizance hua hai. Kai hearing ke baad, kya kehna chahenge sabse pehle? We have been waiting for 39 years for this. We have been fighting on roads, the victims, the community or the law-abiding citizens. And three clean chits, rightly said, was given by them. It was all political show. It was all that all the murderers or the perpetrators was given Z plus security were made ministers so that nothing should go wrong with them. And Rajiv Gandhi made it sure that jab bada ped geta do dharti hilti he justified the killing. I have submitted the sting which voice sample was taken uh, of Jagdish Teitler and report will be submitted, must be submitted with the, the just... Uh, Today the report was submitted. Today the report was submitted. What was the outcome? We'll come to know. But the thing is that why he's let off till date? Because he has already purchased Surinder Singh or his son or the other witnesses. It is on record. Why is he left out? If there are three witnesses now, then why are you giving him chance to again uh, go and play with the witnesses? He is master of that. He, he has money power. He has goons. He can do anything. So you are demanding arrest? 100% arrest. I think CBI should have asked for arrest today only. Why he was not arrested today? But finally, wheels of justice uh, are beginning to roll is what you think? Yes. Yes, we are hopeful and we will fight. Uh, tooth and nail and even during Congress regime when two uh, uh, clean chits were given we fought it and they were withdrawn. In fact, let me go across uh, to Bhavtosh, who will be joining us, getting us the details. But before that, let me tell you how the CBI has leveled several charges against the Congress leader, including abetment of murder, rioting, spreading communal harmony. In fact, uh, the BJP has said that Jagdish Taita will no longer be able to escape and that he could be given death penalty as well if he is convicted in this. कॉग्निस लिया कोर्ट में उसमें सुनिश्चित है कि टाइटलर को अब सजा होगी होगी अब टाइटलर इसमें से बच नहीं सकेगा क्योंकि जिन मैटर्स में है वो 148 153 ए 188 147 और 302 199 और 259 ये सब ऐसे मैटर है जिसमें उसको फांसी की सजा बहुत लंबा समय लगा 39 साल लग गए लेकिन आज इंसाफ के दरवाजे फिर से खुले 
और जगदीश टाइटलर के खिलाफ जो चार्जशीट फाइल हुई थी उसकी कोर्ट ने कॉगिजेंस ली बहुत जल्दी जगदीश टाइटलर भी को सजा होगी सज्जन कुमार की तरह होगी और उम्मीद करते हैं कि उसको सजाए मौत हो उन्नीस में जो कत्लेम इसने किया आज कोर्ट ने ये माना कि विटनेस सामने है जिसने इसको परिवार के लोगों को मरवाते देखा है कांग्रेस जो आज तक इन कातलों को बचाती रही आज राहुल गांधी के पास सोनिया गांधी के पास कोई जवाब नहीं है In fact, big breaking news which is coming in Times now has also spoken to the head of the Supreme Court, appointed SIT, which is overseeing investigations into the anti-Sikh riots. In fact, he says that the courts are just doing their duty, and every step towards justice is welcome. This is Digna. You headed the SIT, which reopened several closed anti-Sikh riot cases. Now, after mm -hmm. Sajjan Kumar, now another big fish, Jagdish Titler, is in trouble as uh, court has taken uh, cognizance of the CBI charge sheet against him, including murder. Uh, your mm -hmm. reaction, Justice Digna? What can be my reaction if court has taken cognizance? Because you headed the SIT, and uh, your no, panel. But, uh, I, uh, there was.